traveling the loneliest road in America on our way to Austin, Nevada. No cars. Okay, we're at the Austin uh, County Courthouse. It's called Lander County Courthouse. And it looks like it was established in 1869. We're gonna go get our book stamp there. <laughs> Hi! Oh, you're almost there, halfway there. <laughs> yes, we are. There's two. Have you guys enjoyed Highway 50 so far? We sure yes. have. It's just been a really fantastic drive. So I many love it beautiful too. Beautiful scenery. Yeah. And, uh, love all the old west towns here. And yes. It's just really fascinating. Me too. Not only the old towns, but just the fact that it's slower and you don't get run over by all the traffic. Exactly. So the lady at the trading post um, where we got our book stamped told us that uh, the Main Street shops here were owned by this lady. Um, and she had to abandon them um, basically because her son got sick and they had to move closer to doctors which could help them. She had also uh, bought the Catholic Church which is pretty historic around here and she was in the process of renovating it. Um, she had uh, made it into a community center and hopefully we can kind of show that to you. I'm not sure if we can or not, but um, it's really a fascinating story. Kind of sad because these shops are going to be kind of left here for a while until somebody can buy them. They're all up for sale. This looks like an abandoned mine shaft. Not sure. Lex and me have decided to um, walk the road up to Stokes Castle. We'll see how far we can get before we see it, but we decided not to take the car because even though it's a well-maintained gravel road, we just didn't want to take any chances. So, just walking along. And we'll talk to you when we get up there. Is that Lewis Stokes? Wow, so Lex, we did find it. We certainly did, yeah. Uh, it's, the road is too windy for our car, but it certainly is fascinating to look at. Uh, it was uh, built, I believe, in 1893, uh, or finished then, uh, by an uh, Eastern capitalist named Stokes for his wife. He built it for his wife, and she hated it. Not really the castle but she just hated being out in the country mm -hmm. so they only lived there for two months and then it was abandoned but still it stands mm -hmm. and there it is right there um, again the lady at the uh, outpost store said that um, it is abandoned there used to be wooden stairways inside but they were burnt out by vagrants and um, pretty much what you see here is what you get. Very striking. 
overlooking the whole valley. Somebody wow. is in there. She kind of scared me. I was like, is this haunted or something? <laughs> I know. <laughs> okay.